In this video, we will demonstrate how to properly execute a spinning heel kick in two different forms. The most basic form of spinning heel kick is to have a straight leg spin all the way around 360 and come back. The striking zone is with the bottom of the heel. Toes pulled back, toes down as much as possible, strike with the back of the heel. Secondary, this is good for breaking boards. Secondary is to extend the foot like a roundhouse, slapping with the bottom of the foot. This gives you an extra set of inches to kick with. It is more efficient for sparring so you do not injure someone when you're kicking. So I'll show you the straight legged version. Leg is straight, spins all the way around and down. And down. Stay straight the whole way. And you see it's a rather slow kick because when your leg is extended, you cannot spin as fast. So the more advanced version of this is to chamber, just like we do in the side kick, the back turning kick, the hook kick, and the spinning hook kick. So chambering, putting the opposite foot the other direction. We chamber, we extend again at 45 degrees, pull it back in at 45 degrees, like such. Now the key here is to point the back foot the opposite direction of the kick and to lean back so we can open the hips up. See how much we lean back? You can hear that snap from the leg extending and coming back. It's a quick snap or a hook. Now performing this for jumping, the old traditional way is to tuck the other leg up, just like when you do a jumping roundhouse. Leg is tucked. However, to create more torque, we're going to throw the opposite leg the other direction. As in a jumping roundhouse, it spins the other direction, creating more torque and more power. Spinning heel kick, you do the same thing. Throwing the leg the opposite direction. Both legs spin out as in the splits. executed jumping, spinning, crescent kick, 360 degrees. Very devastating kick. Useful in the sparring position. Someone's coming up against you. You step back. Target them in the head. It's a knockout kick par excellence. 